expand, to build, to evolve, to do things bigger, better, try new aspects of creativity. Rihanna is a singer, actor, fashion designer, and entrepreneur from Barbados. Rihanna was discovered by Evan Rogers, an American song producer who asked her to make a demo recording in the United States. She quickly rose to prominence after signing with Def Jam in 2005, releasing her first two studio albums, Music of the Sun 2005 and A Girl Like Me 2006, both of which were inspired by Caribbean music and charted in the top 10 of the US Billboard 200 list. She became the first black woman to lead a luxury brand for the LVMH, Mott Hennessy Louis Vuitton Group in 2017, when she established the fashion company Fenty as its creative director. Oh, in like an, a, an old armory and it was really hot and sweaty. <laughs> and we really only had limited resources to work with. If you enjoy these videos, please remember to hit the like button as it does help us out a lot. And comment below who your favorite celebrity is that you'd love to see in an upcoming video. Her full name is Robin Rihanna Fenty, but is also known as Bad Girl. She was born February 20th, 1988 in St. Michael, Barbados, making her 33 at the time of this production. She stands at 5 feet 8 inches tall. Rihanna enjoys watching television and listening to music on her days off, which are few and far between. In her spare time, she's just like the rest of us. If she has the time, she'll frequently go shopping at the mall for apparel and other things. She's also a generous philanthropist who founded the Believe Foundation to assist terminally sick children. In 2008 and 2014, she took part in various activities to raise awareness about HIV and AIDS. Furthermore, following Hurricane Sandy, she contributed $100 million to a food bank, assisting those whose lives were ruined by the superstorm. Rihanna started dating Chris Brown, a fellow artist, in 2007. Rihanna dated Drake on and off for the next two years after their romance ended in February 2009. However, Rihanna revealed in a January 2013 interview with Rolling Stone that she had renewed her relationship with Chris Brown despite the fact that he was still on probation for the 2009 domestic violence incident. The revelation came after months of speculation in the media about the couple's reunion. Brown said that he and Rihanna had broken up again in a May 2013 interview. In 2017, Rihanna started dating Saudi businessman Hassan Jamil. The pair is said to have broken up in January 2020. and the Amazon Prime video audience to see a male representation in a brand that hadn't really explored that before. Rihanna was born to Monica, an accountant, and Ronald Fenty, a warehouse supervisor. Her mother is of Afro-Guyanese ancestry, while her father is of African and Irish descent from Barbados. Rihanna has two brothers, Rory and Rahad Fenty, as well as two half-sisters and a half-brother from her father's prior marriages, all of whom were born to separate mothers. She grew up in a three-bedroom house in Bridgetown, where she and her father had a street cart selling clothing. Her father's alcoholism and crack cocaine addiction impacted her upbringing and led to her parents' difficult marriage. Rihanna's father used to physically beat her mother, and she would attempt to intervene to stop conflicts from breaking out. Rihanna underwent many CT scans as a kid for her severe migraines. The doctors even believed it was a tumor since it was so bad. Her parents had separated by the time she was 14 and her health started to recover. She grew up with reggae music playing in the background. She went to Combermere School and Charles F. Broom Memorial Primary School where she was classmates with future international cricketers Chris Jordan and Carlos Brothway. Rihanna was a cadet in a sub-military program and her drill instructor was the late Barbadian singer-songwriter Chantel. She had intended to graduate from high school, but instead decided to pursue a musical career. Rihanna and two of her friends created a musical group in 2003. Evan Rogers, an American record producer, found her in her native Barbados. The female trio landed an audition with Rogers despite having no name or content. Once Rogers said in an interview that the minute Rihanna came into the room, it was like the other two girls didn't exist. Rihanna went to Rogers' hotel room and sang Destiny's Child's Emotion and Mariah Carey's Hero, among other songs. 
Rogers was so taken by Rihanna that he arranged a second meeting with her, this time with her mother in attendance, and then asked her to visit his hometown in the United States to make a demo recording that might be submitted to record companies. Because she could only record during school vacations, the recordings were irregular and took approximately a year. Two songs recorded for the demo tape, Pond de Replay and The Last Time, were ultimately featured on her first album, Music of the Sun. Rihanna was signed to Rogers and Carl Sturkin's production firm, Syndicated Rhythm Productions, in the same year. Rihanna's demo was sent to Def Jam Recordings, where it was heard for the first time by Jay Brown, an A&R executive at the company. Brown performed the demo tape for Jay-Z, who'd just been named president and CEO of Def Jam Records. Jay-Z thought the song Pawn to Replay was too large for her when he first heard it. He encouraged Rihanna to audition for the company despite his reservations. Rihanna auditioned for Def Jam in New York City in early 2005 when she was introduced to music entrepreneur Antonio L.A. Reed by Jay-Z. She sang a rendition of Whitney Houston's For the Love of You during the audition, as well as demo songs Home to Replay and The Last Time. After seeing her perform her upcoming song Home to Replay, Jay-Z was convinced he wanted to sign her. L.A. Reid, his supervisor, was so pleased by Rihanna's audition that he told Jay-Z not to allow her to leave the building until the contract was signed. Reed delegated the closing of the transaction to Jay-Z and his crew, which culminated in a six-album record contract with Def Jam. She stayed in Jay-Z's office until 3 a.m. waiting for attorneys to write a contract because he didn't want her to sign with another label. Rihanna postponed another record label meeting and moved from Barbados to the United States to live with Rogers and his wife. Rihanna has dabbled with a variety of companies and fields. She signed an endorsement agreement with Secret Body Spray in October 2005. She appeared in an Optus ad in 2010 in promotion of Rihanna's Last Girl on Earth. In the same year, Rihanna and rapper Pitbull appeared in a Kodak ad. The singer published an eponymous book in October 2010. The book was released in conjunction with Rihanna's fourth studio album, Rated R, and included photographs from her album, Last Girl on Earth. In August 2012, her debut television show, Style to Rock, aired on Sky Living in the United Kingdom. Rihanna, Nicola Roberts, Lisa Cooper, and Henry Holland helped up-and-coming British designers develop their clothing collections in the 10-week series. In 2013, the singer teamed up with MAC Cosmetics to launch her own Riri Loves MAC Summer, Autumn, and Holiday Cosmetic Collections. In July 2013, beer producer Budweiser announced that Rihanna will appear in their worldwide Made for Music campaign, which also included Jay-Z. It doesn't necessarily have to be bigger, but maybe it's deeper. Maybe we just go deeper and, and explore things that aren't being discussed. Rihanna's annual income varies depending on her promotional and release cycles, but she reportedly earns from anywhere around $40 million to $70 million per year. Rihanna's net worth is $1.7 billion. Rihanna reportedly spent $13.8 million on a Beverly Hills property in March of 2021, making it her most costly real estate acquisition to date. The 5,909 square foot mansion is in the post office neighborhood of Beverly Hills. Rihanna spent $10 million on the property next door to her $13.8 million Beverly Hills mansion just a few months after buying it. Built in 1939, the 3,549-square-foot home features four bedrooms and four-and-a-half bathrooms. Cars you'll find in her garage include a Porsche 997 Turbo, a Porsche 911 Turbo S, a Chevrolet Suburban LTZ, a Lamborghini Aventador, a Mercedes SLR McLaren, and a Maybach 57S.
Rihanna owns a Fraser Yachts Charter Latitude.